An A-list actor renouncing his movie before it's even out. Why Jim Carrey says Kick-Ass 2 does not kick ass. Carrey stars as a superhero in the upcoming sequel, which is rated R for strong violence. He is an advocate of gun control and his character uses a baseball bat, not a gun. But over the weekend, he seemed to decide that even that was too much, tweeting, I did kick ass a month before Sandy Hook, and now, in all good conscience, I cannot support that level of violence. Apologies to others involved with the film. I am not ashamed of it, but recent events have caused a change in my heart. The movies are based on comic books by Mark Miller, who responded on his website. I'm baffled by this sudden announcement as nothing seen in this picture wasn't in the screenplay 18 months ago. Miller added that he does not think violence on screen leads to violence in real life and that he hopes Carrie will reconsider, especially because he's brilliant in the film. Cinema Blend is equally confused. We have no clue what these recent events to which he refers are. Maybe it's been a concern that's been brewing. Maybe the trailers have made him take stock. Maybe he has seen a final cut of the film and that has made him feel uncomfortable. The original movie out in 2010 was dubbed as ultraviolet by many but was also widely praised by critics and did well at the box office. Carey did not appear in the original. Again, Carey is a gun control advocate and has spoken out about gun violence in the past. He commented when the Colorado movie theater shootings happened and in April wrote a piece for the Huffington Post clarifying he thinks the right to bear arms should remain but he wants access to weapons to be more monitored. Kick-Ass 2 is scheduled to hit theaters August 16th. It is unclear where the 51-year-old actor will go from here. Will he do PR for the film? We'll have to wait and see. Thanks for watching Newsy. I'm Lauren Zima.